a lot of people think that an API is just the resources. What data am I returning? It's mm -hmm. like, well, how do you group those blocks of data into capabilities? Those capabilities are not unique across the company either. So like every com every large company I've worked at um, has usually a supply chain and a digital e-commerce presence. So they have a digital product and a supply chain product and maybe a manufacturing product. Well, each one of them owns the product model, but they're different product models. Mm -hmm. So if you just look at the product resource, it could have 400 attributes or it could have 10, depending on what the context is. If you start namespacing them or putting them into context, well, now you have the ability to separate the capabilities, really build out a holistic design, and it even goes to the microservices of now I can group things logically that are going to run together and protect those resources instead of having a distributed monolith to where, well, I need to really interact with these two resources, but to do it, I have to do 20 other steps. I mean, we talk about this. I mean, you build the, you, you pick the right tool for the right job, yep. right? It's like, we have a distributed monolith. I say we, in some cases, we broke down that monolith and it's just all in pieces all over. But what, what problems are we actually fixing or are we actually making more, pro making more problems for ourselves? 